Hey everybody, welcome to another Minecraft Story Mode episode. Today we're going to start executing the plan that we made last episode to take down Romeo. So without further ado, let's just jump right into it. Time to find Stella. An ocelot, what is that for? just keeps getting weirder and weirder. Jesse, I did what you asked. Now there are pork chops for everyone. Would you like to taste one? I made it myself. No, no, thank you. And you know what? You could change to carrots if you wanted. I'll, I'll do that. Thank you, Jesse. Maybe, maybe I'll get some new pigs. Hmm? I'll be the dentist and Countess. Pink Paisley the fourth. <laughs> Hope that didn't get this guy in trouble. Another ocelot? What are these for? There was a guy staring through the crack of that building. <gasps> Yo! Jesse, dude! Just unveiled the new statue you built. <laughs> yeah. It's got, um, character? Yeah, I kind of liked the old one, but... Whoa! Hey, I mean, you know what? This one is totally rad. I cannot keep my eyes off it. <laughs> Sha. You know what? I change my mind. Let's bring the old one back, shall we? Dude! I can't wait to see it again. Not that, you know, this one wasn't... Like, go with your gut, dude! Especially if it wants the old one back. Sha. Righteous! Thanks, Jesse, dude! What? Wh where? Where is my statue? You there, Nelly? What happened to my statue? The uh, the one you just tore down because your gut told you to? What? What are you talking about? What is she talking about? Like two seconds ago, you you, you were. You want to blame your insolence on me? Golems, take her away! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Calm yourself, dude. Like. Take some deep breaths, okay? <sighs> oh, no. No.
Stella. I wanted one thing from you. More fireworks and banners. Uh, it's not my fault. I, I have other stuff. Then hire more people. Force them, conscript them, I don't care. Jesse Khan will be the greatest thing this town has ever seen, or I will personally ensure you pay the price. Where the heck am I supposed to get more people? Bingo, that's our ticket in. It's now or never. Perfect, now we can. Oh, Gravel, where are those extra Jesse banners? Oh! Stella! Jesse, back so soon. <laughs> Since when do you... Hmm, you're not the admin, are you? Hmm? Hmm? Come on, of course I'm the admin. I'm absolutely, completely, totally the admin. Jesse! I knew it! Keep your voice down, all right? I am so glad you're back. Pretending to be the other Jesse's loyal servant has been exhausting. Wait, why am I just finding out now you're back? Don't you trust me, Jesse? I thought you'd move past your competitive nature with me. I am part of your core gang. I hate being left out of the loop like this. I wanted to, but it wasn't safe to contact you with you being so close to the admin. Oh, you were protecting me. We are such best friends. Look, Stella, I need these uniforms to defeat the admin. I don't have time to explain all the... No problemo, friendo. Carry on with your top secret mission. I won't spill anything to the admin. I happen to be an excellent actor. I shall get into character. Let's just, uh, separate, okay? Roger that. Exeunt stage left! is uncanny it's amazing more like terrifying what's wrong binta the admin he's right there right in front of me all the suffering he's caused killing fred inflicting sorrow on my people he's so close i could just charge the stage and take my justice now standing here idly seeing that Smile! It'd be useless. There aren't any weapons that can even touch him right now. Our only hope is getting that word of passage up to the tower. <sighs> You're right. Attacking him now would only doom us all. And as Jesse, your Jesse, I'm glad we Let's go to work. Come together to celebrate me. Of course it was mandatory, but I sense that you wanted to come anyway. So thank you. No one permitted back here except... Fireworks, you mean, huh? Jeez, well, get back there, then. Thank you. Now we can get to our jobs that we're totally qualified to do. <sighs> I'll find a bucket and report back. Good luck. I hope you can pull this off. Fireworks. Just stuff. Come on. Who plans a convention with no fireworks? That's like planning a birthday party without... You know. <sighs> Why can't it ever be easy? <laughs> Please. 
When has it ever been easy? Easy or not, I can't help but notice that we still don't have any fireworks. I guess we'll just need to make some. There has to be enough supplies to craft some paper around here. Then, all we need is gunpowder and a fireworks star. Oh, that would really add some flash. We'll keep a lookout on the exits and stage. Okay, at least it looks like the fireworks union guys already dropped off the fireworks stars. Which one should I take? Love this one. It makes the firework shape like a green creeper face. Sugar cane. This isn't stupid. Gunpowder. Perfect. Town has improved from the moment I ascended as your leader. The sky is brighter, cows are happier, pie is sweeter. I actually don't even think it's possible for you to thank me enough. Okay, once I've got a bucket, that'll be the perfect spot to fill her up. Hey, you hearing this, doof? Which proves I'm the greatest thing ever to happen in all your lives. Let's look at the mathematical proof. What a self-absorbed... Ugh. Only for a little while longer. Yeah, we'll get Beacon Town back. I can feel it. This book. Whoever owns this chest must be a fan. Okay, let's get crafting. There's a firework. Nice. Now just need to... Hey, Glenn, I... Wait a minute. You ain't Glenn. And you ain't... <laughs> huh. Yeah. That felt... That felt good. Really good. Maybe we can't hurt the admin yet, but we can still take out his goons. We've come too far to second-guess ourselves. And we can't let anyone get in our way. Maybe not quite so hard next time. Yes, right. Sorry. Ha! <laughs> not bad. Yeah, I think we've given Binta a bit of a taste for combat. Did you get the bucket? Right here. Good luck up there. I'm going to check on my people. You're welcome back here when this is over. Thank you, Jesse, for everything. Okay, all strapped.
locked in, fireworks ready. Oh, no! Uh, Jesse! Uh, hey, Jesse! Yeah! Jesse, we want to talk to you more about how great it is being your friend. Just need to. Oh, perfect. Just what I needed. Ha! Ah, too slow, dummy. Come at me, ugly. Uh oh. Whew, that was close. Okay, time to get the others. I'm glad to see that waterfall. Yeah, we were getting kind of nervous down there. Sorry, the welcoming committee was a little strict. Come on, let's get inside. Okay, I'm not the only one that finds all this silence freaky, right? This place is dead. Definitely strange. Though I imagine you might be relieved to have a little quiet right now, huh? I was almost expecting, I don't know, another huge boss battle or something when we got in here. Yeah, the admin definitely seems to like those. But nothing. Don't be fooled, guys. If it's this quiet on our way to depower the admin, then it's gotta be a trap. Well, I'm not seeing anything trappish yet, but I'll keep an eye out. What's going on? Stand down, Ocelots. Lucas! Looks like the tables have finally turned, huh, Jesse? We can't let you keep doing what you're doing. That's enough now. Whoa, sorry. Oh, man, I am so happy to see you. I can't believe how long it's been. What are you talking about? We just talked the other day, remember? Your whole speech about how if I couldn't get in line, I could just hit the road? Now, hang on, everyone. No. It's our turn to talk. Not yours. Not anymore. I reformed the Ocelots because I wanted to remind everyone of how things were before. And most of all, I wanted to remind you. No, Because but... the Jesse I know wouldn't be running around on some power trip locking people up. Lucas. So, yeah. I set your prisoners free. What are you gonna do about it? Yeah, and telling us our builds were ugly. Well, I am so glad you guys are all free. I didn't do any of this. What are you talking about? You were laughing, gloating as you teleported people away. Everything you think I've told you since I came back from the Ice Palace 
was a lie. The admin locked me in a prison underground, took my identity, came back here, and pretended to be me. That is... No. How do we know this isn't a trick? No trick, friend. And it's not the first time. My friend Voss, the admin did the same thing with him. Yeah, we saw the whole thing. Is this really true? All those horrible things you did that... Okay. Yeah. It's you. Well, now that we have that sorted out... What in the world are we gonna do next? Wait, why are you even in here? We're trying to get to something called the terminal. We have a word of passage. <coughs> Potato. That we can apparently use to take away the admin's powers for good. Yeah, a lot of that was way over my head, especially the potato, but I'm in. You just lead the way, and the new ocelots will have your back. Well, would you look at this. Romeo's quite the Jesse memorabilia collector. I know we don't have much time, but it might be smart to suit up properly. Agreed. All right, which suit are we going to pick here? Red Sun Riot, Golden Goliath, Ender Defender, Star Shield, Shield of Infinity, Adamantium, Impervium, Tim's Armor, Swordbreaker, or Dragon's Bane. You know what? Let's take Dragon's Bane. Let's do this, Dragon's Bane. Now you look like you're ready for a showdown. Agreed. Oh, thanks, guys. Time to end this. Ocelots! Oh! Okay, if I were a terminal, what would I look like? Why, hello there. Wasn't expecting you. And we're going to end it right there, guys, for this episode. So next episode, we'll see what is going on. But for now, we're going to end it, guys. If you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as it puts my channel. And I will see you guys later. God bless and goodbye.